Prime Minister Ismail Sabri Yaakob's government has nominated Pontian MP Ahmad Maslan as its sole candidate for the position of Dewan Rakyat Deputy Speaker. When contacted by Malaysia Kini, Amnos Padang Rengas MP Muhammad Nazri Abdul Aziz confirmed the nomination. The Deputy Speaker position fell vacant after Amnos Pengerang MP Azalina Othman Said resigned on the 23rd of August. Azalina said she hoped her resignation could spur a reset of the upcoming Dewan Rakyat sitting. She had also proposed that an opposition candidate be given the post. But this proposal had been rejected by Nazri. Previously, he was quoted by Sina Harian as saying that the deputy speaker position still needs to be filled with a government candidate and they would not make way for the opposition to fill it. Nazri said the opposition should not be demanding the position when it didn't make the same offer when Pakatan Harapan was in power. Meanwhile, Batugaja MP V. Siva Kumar has spoken out against Ahmad's nomination. In a statement, he said it was shocking to note that Ismail Sabri had reportedly nominated an accused who has been charged in court with corrupt practice and breaching money laundering laws as a candidate for deputy speaker. He noted that Bursatu President Muhyiddin Yassin had vowed not to work with kleptocrats and questioned if that position has changed. Ahmad, who is also AMNO's Secretary General, is presently standing trial for money laundering and providing a false statement to the Malaysian Anti-Corruption Commission. Over 2 million ringgit he received from then-Prime Minister Najib Abdul Razak in 2013.